Alright, welcome back. So, after we went all the way to the left from that room we were just in, uh, you can talk to these red suits here. I don't know why they would make them wear these flamboyant red suits. It's kind of, I'd be degraded. They look crazy weird. <laughs> you can buy stuff from this one, the second one here. And there's going to be three guards in this room and two dogs. So, use the trank in the head method and run back. Get out your pepper spray. Get ready to pepper spray them as they walk by. And they'll run into your gas. Like that guy didn't, but uh, equip your fist augmentation and beat the shit out of him. Or cattle prod him, it doesn't really matter whatever saves you the most blah, 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 most health. Fortunately I have a red torso now, so that's bad. And there's a guy with a dog over here. If they're far away like this on a ramp, you can take out the guy and just run back and um he'll be knocked out before he makes it to this room. And I accidentally went to the room on the left and talked to this uh, guy here. Uh, it was a complete accident, but there's the second one he's knocked out. And I go back and take care of the guard or whatever. Dog now. So shoot the dog. He'll, he doesn't uh, go around corners well. As you can see, he just falls down. And when he's trying to make it back up, he gets knocked out. Uh, he, dogs, of course, knock out quicker than animal or people. And there's a second dog over there. I take care of him later. I should have taken care of him right now, and you probably should as well, but uh, we'll take care of him later. Because we're badasses like that. Cattle prod this guy in this room. And pick up any ammo you may need. Data cube, no that's cigarettes, that's not data cube. <laughs> now you can head into the medical area where we were just accidentally went into. Now we talked to this guy, so he's not gonna talk to us again and head down this vent on the first room on the right and for some reason I couldn't get past these uh, stairs or this ladder here but uh... eventually I did do it, I had to kind of I think I, yeah, I cut it out because it was taking too long and it for some reason wouldn't let me pass so take the first left going down these vents then you'll see a dead cat oh poor kitty then take the second left and you might want to heal your head up there because I had five head health and there's gonna be a and save, save, save before you do this, because this can be a really, really tough part. Um, make sure your electric prod is reloaded, because we're going to take out our first man in black, the guy we saw at UNATCO, who was with Walton Simons, and I got really lucky that the electric prod took him out, because sometimes it, using a full electric prod doesn't take him out. And just crawl into the nearest vent and wait for all the soldiers to stop shooting and looking for you. Pick up a nano key off of his body that's <laughs> just laying stiff boarded on the table there. Get a med kit from this. You might want to crouch just to be safe in case the soldiers see you or something. So they don't see you. Use a multi-tool in this augmentation. Uh, storage. <clears throat> and this is one we're actually going to use. Yay! So pick that up. And head back to the vent we were just in, or 
head back to the vent that was behind that desk if you weren't just in and go down this ladder make sure you have your trank dart with equipped to trank and trank that little green thing there uh, don't let him get close to you he doesn't die he just shoots poisonous crap at you that kills you really fast probably because my torso is really low health but wait for him to kind of get around wait for the right moment to escape so he doesn't shoot you with anything I probably should have waited a little longer but uh he doesn't get me with anything fortunately and I head back through the vents we just came through and head back down the vent we got into this room with or don't I forgot something again I'm always forgetting stuff uh, over here in this cabinet use a black pick or the nano key ring on it and there's a multi-tool in there you can get now leave through the vent we came in this room on and pass the dead poor kitty And we can throw that ballistic summer down, I don't know why I hold on to it. But take the right, and then the left, then the right again. And head out this room, and you can pick up this uh, box up here, which we're going to break into later. You might not want to break into it right there, be near the guards, because they can probably hear it. But uh, you want to break into it kind of in this hallway, because there's going to be a guard up here. So you want to duck past this window because if you run past it, he'll get alerted and so will the secretary somehow. And I think he sees me right there, but he's just standing there looking. And then run inside and just spray some pepper spray around. Equip your fist and just beat the shit out of him. Beat the shit out of the secretary. They're both unconscious. You can pick up a prod charger off the secretary and there's nothing useful off of the guard. Now head up the stairs. And there's a guard right there so we don't want to go up these stairs exactly. I went up the wrong stairs. Head up the stairs on the right. Uh, from that lady's office. And that doctor won't come after you as you can see your crosshair is green on her so uh... go into the vent you just use the nano key we got earlier on it which we didn't get so we have to lock pick it ah. I just woke up sorry <laughs> these voiceovers are a little crazy head all the way to the back towards the gate over the left when we get to the through this to the end of the slider we're actually not going to stop I kind of found a, another piece of footage I could fit in um, head down it there's not going to be that crazy thing that shoots poison at you and you're going to be in the kind of holding cell or the medical lab where uh, Paul was being held sorry I kind of had a hiccup right there and that door is usually open but it's closed now so you don't have to close it and you can use an augmentation canister we got earlier and you want to pick the one on the right with the medic kind of sign and heal yourself because I took a lot of damage talk to Paul